All right, everyone, welcome back to the channel. Looking at Jasmine. So a quick update here on Jasmine. A couple of things on the chart that I need to point out. Uh, the first thing is a little concerning that we fell back below that 007 level. Uh, but we're still extremely bullish here. We held our 21-day EMA at the moment. So we're at 0068. Our 21 is at 0066. So as long as we hold the 21, we're holding this uptrend here. And we're extremely bullish still. Uh, to grind higher here on Jasmine. So if we can bounce from here, which we may, you can see the stock RSI size coming back down to the bottom. Uh, the last time it did that, you could see we were down here and we were holding support on this uptrend and we started to move higher from there. So that's not concerning there. No, we're at support. We may get a nice little bounce here. So you're looking at about a 3% bounce to get back over that 007 and then about a 10% bounce, a 9 to 10% bounce to get up here to the 200 day moving average once again and we'll give that another shot of trying to get over that 0075 level here so we need a good bounce here on jasmine uh, with that said like i said you're still extremely bullish here as long as you hold the 21 and this little uptrend uh you're still considered bullish even if we fall down here to the bottom or the top of this fib rather to this 64 level so we could drop down here to 64 and you're still bullish for a move higher um with that said, if we look over at the Heikinashi candles, Heikinashi right now is still printing red, a larger red candle here with no shadow. So it does have a little uh, strong trend to the downside at the moment. So it's very crucial that we hold this 21 day EMA here and then ultimately the 6.4 here to remain bullish here. Uh, we're still alive if we end up losing the 21 and this 64 and our moving averages here and we come back down to the box to the bottom here. So this 5-4 level in this box, if we lose this box, Jasmine is probably going back down, you know, as they say, to zero. Not actually zero, but it's going back down. Um, so if we end up losing this box, this would be your time to um, dollar cost average in on Jasmine as it comes down. But until then, you know, we're still grinding higher. We're still extremely bullish at the moment. So just watch the 21 here at 0066. As long as we bounce from here, we're still holding the uptrend. We're still good. If we lose that, like I said, 6-4 is your last um, line of defense, as you would say, to remain bullish for a grind higher, for a push higher, rather. Uh, so just watch those two prices there. Like I said, we really need to get back over the 007 level here to continue our little journey up. Uh, but it looks good right now. There's nothing really bearish besides the fact that we fell back below that 007 level. And with that said, you can see that uh, here on the chart now, I did draw this big red box here. Uh, this is our box to get over. If we can get through this price area from 0079 to 008, uh, then Jasmine is definitely going to hit a penny, as you can see here at this 1618, and potentially a lot higher. This is pretty much our moon line here. If we can get through this price area here uh, and hold that as support, Jasmine's going to start going to the moon, moon, like, like to the moon. So there's really nothing going to uh, stop it. If we switch out here to the three-day chart and the weekly chart, uh, we'll go ahead and go to the weekly chart so you can see what I'm talking about. Where I drew this box at, you can see this is where we held support back here. Fell below it. We got stuck. Got stuck. So if we do not break through this on this little run, this is going to be a double top here on the weekly chart, and we're probably going to end up falling off the table. So we really need to keep grinding higher and get through this box here. So like right now, like I said, it looks extremely well and hopefully we can continue this uptrend here on Jasmine. So before this gets too long, uh, just keep an eye on the 21 day EMA and we need to get back over 007 and then ultimately the 200 and then ultimately the box up here. Um, so we'll see how it plays out. We'll cover it every day or we do cover it every day here on the channel. So hopefully that helped a little bit. And with that said, not financial advice. Thanks for watching everyone. Peace out.